Wembley. International soccer. Sweden playing right to left versus England. A highly entertaining and clean match spiced with four grand goals. The sort of game that football enthusiasts don't easily forget and one which earned the top international goal-scoring record for England striker Bobby Charlton. The England squad were in fine form, playing great football and taking every opportunity. Charlton unleashed a mighty one, but Larsen, in the Swedish goal, coped with it. The Swedes, too, knew their stuff. They attacked strongly, probing for England weak spots, but Stepney wasn't one of them. This was an England raid which eventually led to their first goal. Hunt with a short corner to Charlton, taking the return pass. He centred and Peters headed home. In the 35th minute, England were one up. Were they satisfied? Not likely. Bobby Charlton was goal hungry. Just watch that man slam home his record-breaking goal. In his 85th senior international, Charlton had notched his 45th goal. He was England's all-time top scorer. At half-time, England were two ahead, and on the resumption looked very menacing. Charlton had done his bit, and Sir Alf Ramsey had sent Hurst on to take his place. The England forwards were all in sparkling form. Spurred on by that near miss, England came away again. Hurst beat right back Christensen and put the ball into the middle. Another escape for the Swedes. Sweden's turn to menace the goal mouth. An over-eager defender brought down a Swede. A free kick, but no hard feelings. Stepney dealt safely with that hand stinger. Back down to the other end, where the England front line were piling on the pressure. Knowles collected the centre. His jet-propelled drive hit the bar. He bounded to Hurst, who gave it to Hunt. Goal! England 3, Sweden 0. The visitors were desperate not to go home goalless. Time was running out fast. At last, their chance came through a mistake by Norman Hunter. Anderson pounced to crack in a grand consolation goal with the last kick of the game. It had been a first-class match which showed England's potential for honours in the European Championship. Had over